Morning girls, how are we doing? Welcome back to a foodie beauty, Marion the Revert, the Revert of the Marion of the day, every day of the beauties. This is shopping day, lush mall lunch, and giant tiger. Fantastic. She's probably going to show us, because <laughs> she's using old, old footage, right? like that hen thing from the other day. She is obviously going to show us how she got that incredible picture of the tiger framed and everything like that. You know, the one that's not actually put up on the wall of the house or anything like that. It's just kind of sitting on the back of a sofa, which is like something I did when I first moved into my house. I would just have like pictures propped up against the wall. But eventually I found a screwdriver and I was able to like fix them. But she has only been in her mm, beach side apartment for one year. So I wouldn't really expect her to be able to like do much of herself. Uh, I guess this looks like a barren wasteland, I guess. You know, it kind of looks like probably, the, oh, actually no, there's a couple cars down there. I can see like, a couple cars down there. So there are more people who exist in Canada than there are in <laughs> in all of Kuwait apparently. Um, yeah, Canada, it's just kind of just dry looking. I guess this is what a Canadian spring would look like. Because for me, I always think Canada, I always just think snow. <laughs> like, the like good Canadian um, winter, that's all I think of. Uh, it's because it kind of looks like America, you know? But that's how, that's how we picture America, which is like barns and like endless just rolling tundras and stuff like that. Because it's kind of like um, with the Foodie, with the Amberlynn Reed retro series I'm doing. This looks like Kentucky to me, you know? But that is me as an uncultured person because everything in Ireland is green. So we don't have anything that looks like this or big, weird looking like kind of barns like that that I would expect them to drive the tractor out of. I've kind of rambled for a while about this because I don't care about lush mall lunches or, or giant tiger. Giant tiger is kind of a weird one. I guess we're going to go. Let's go. Oh. Hello, hello guys welcome why are you so quiet like my audio test you were fine to another Jesus. Canada vlog bye car so today i am going with some family bye car to have a no wonderful... you're not <laughs> i'm going with some family members. no you're not i don't believe you at all foodie um that's this is sped up again this is only 1.25 speed and those cars are whipping faster faster than it would be at 1.25 speed okay we're gonna go on a little road trip we're gonna have lunch we're gonna exciting. go to the park oh my god we're gonna go shopping i have i guess, I guess she isn't probably is Polly in the dry in the passenger side this time? I guess. Would you trust? Would you ever get in the Kia with her? Like, I'm not talking about the stank or anything like that. Um, the definitely totes are real. She put two thousand dollars into it and fixed it. It's like top of the range car, even though its window doesn't like go up or down, and the internal lights burnt out and everything like that. Definitely, it's a brand new car, top of the top of the line model now. Like, would you get in the Kia with her? I wouldn't trust her to drive me anywhere some lush gift cards that oh, I need to spend. So exciting. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to be doing all of those things today. Wow. It's a beautiful day out and I'm inviting you all along with us. Oh, so Yella, yep. come on, let's go. Look, I thought my introduction was long. Oh, oh no, we just got some panning shots. Why wouldn't we just have some more panning shots? So how are you guys doing? Are you guys being hit by the new YouTube terms of service stuff, the changes? Are you guys being hit by the ad blocks? As you can quite clearly see. I'm I'm not. I still I still know how to get around this. <laughs> YouTube coon, you can't get to me. Oh my god, this is actually like how long is this? Oh my god. It's like two minutes of nothing. <laughs> it's actually two minutes of actually nothing at the start of her video. <laughs> she did two minutes. That is a full mineral ad of just nothing. First stop is to St. Albert. There's a cow. <laughs> See, I'm not the only Canadian cow. <laughs> Do you like my joke? <laughs> dairy farm to get some fresh cheese curds. Oh my god. Fresh yeah. from their farm. Oh, I forgot she was making a massive point, guys, that she is, you know, torn between being a, a true Canadian woman and also a hijabi Kuwaiti woman. I forgot about that point. So she's going to get cheese curds because, as I said, her only Canadian feature, apart from saying sorry, is to eat poutine. That they make daily. Oh my god. Wow. Can you make cheese curds daily? Like, I thought cheese curds, I thought a, like a curd of cheese was like, it had to be fermented over time. I thought that's what a curd of cheese was, but I'm not 100% sure. 2 kg bag of cheese curds. Oh my God, she's going to eat oh all of that. Oh my gosh, that would put me in a cheese coma. But... Again. <laughs> Imagine her just shedding herself inside and eat for me. It's like, emergency room, the ambulance person is like rolling her through the, the doors and it's like, I need 300 st st stats, stat, stat. And then like the doctor's like, what happened to her? And it's like, she had two kilograms of cheese curd. She's the most Canadian woman who's ever existed. And like the doctor, like a tear rolls down his cheek and he salutes her, but then he goes and like saves her life, obviously. And then they probably fall in love. I, I've been with ER, I've been watching ER recently. But uh, as much as I'd love to, oh. I'm going to get the smallest bag they have. Sure. So yeah, I'm just gonna get I a believe bag you. of cheese curds. Okay, so we just jump cut, to, like, and we just jump cut. Oh, Giant Tiger's a store. Well, that's a lot less interesting than I thought it was going to be. Okay, like, I love it. The second she picks it up and holds the camera, it's like, 
Okay, cut, 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 cut. And she immediately put it back and grabbed six off the fuck, <laughs> six two kilogram bags and then ran. She shoplifted them actually. That's insider news, guys. Allegedly, she shoplifted. She shoplifted all six bags of cheese curds. She just stuck them up her dress and people walked up to her and was like, Mom, you're sticking out in weird proportions. She's like, I have 450 pounds. Of course, you stick out in weird proportions. And they're like, that is a good point, but we can smell cheese from you. And then she's just like, look at me. Don't you know I just smell like cheese normally? And they're like, fuck, every single point she beats. You don't know what we have to let her go. And she got away with 12 kilograms of cheese. <laughs> I don't know why. That's all I can think about there. Hey, guys. Ugh. So here in Canada, I just do it. Okay, fantastic. Why are we always this close? Why have you got like a a lower lip mustache thing going on there. Look at that, it's a bit of a peach fuzz going on there. I never want to think about peach fuzz when it comes to Chantel, like literally ever. Oh, is that your purse? That's so weird. Oh, actually, never mind. I was about to say it's so weird you're not using the Alice in Wonderland one that definitely totes for real, guys. Her mom, like, hand, hand printed in her Timu sweatshop. Maybe her mom works Timu. Maybe that's, maybe her mom lives in a Timu warehouse and that's why she thinks it was homemade. <laughs> okay, I, I'm just, I, out of sheer curiosity, if your family's here, why are we so close to your face? Why can't one of your family members hold it back for you? Or why can't you get like a selfie stick so we're not always this? When your face is this massive, like, I don't want to be this close. Can we just like, I don't know, shuffle back a little bit, get a tripod, put it on top of your camera, take a little bit of a step back or something like that, just so I'm not like living in one of your pores. I'm doing a vlog today. I'm doing a I'm bit so of shopping. Excited. I'm going to go to Lush right now. Why are you holding up here? That's All right, weird. giant tiger. I know. And we're going to have to so Yella, come with us. And after for lunch, we're gonna eat a giant tiger. Just gonna go see if they have anything of interest, maybe. Wow, look at I the speed know. of her walking. Oh my God, slow down, Chantal, you mad bastard. Let's watch this again. Look how slowly she approaches here. Look at this. Maybe. Look at this. I don't know, just have a look, look around. I have always joked I could outworm these people. Unironically, I actually could. The, the speed of her going in there. I have seen 400 year old women like on like a zimmer frame in a wheelchair going faster than that summer's coming so pool items are important yep. well definitely you still the summer is coming so you use a pool it's like dude, are, are you meant to be able to fit in there like honest to god that looks like, like a gun guard for you like you were going to strap your belly belly into that when you go into the gladiatorial arena it looks like that one just cover the belly area those things are great though for dogs i, I love getting them but probably for kids too i don't like i don't think or, of kids or like kids so i think of them for dogs because you get them especially when you have like a husky because it's really warm sometimes in ireland i say really warm really warm is like 22 degrees uh, <laughs> and sometimes you put water in the dog jumps in and has a good time i love ring pops well ring pops wow is that where Salah got your wedding ring <laughs> This is a shout out for those in the know. As a kid, these are the cheesies. These, these are the cheesies. That is the only time she started happy this entire time. These are the cheesies. Canadian. <laughs> big boy. Is that where she got big boy from? <laughs> is that where she got big boy from? Is cheesy, beasy? Is that where we're getting this all from? Mm, this has really changed her entire life. Hawkins. N not Natter's nose. It was kind of like a hawk's bill. This. This cheesies has set her in trier life. I did say in trier life as well. I ain't changing that because I was also reading twa at the same time. So, I, so for some way, entire became in trier. My wallet for today. Oh my god, that's crazy! I've seen it six times. Whoa, I get some socks. socks. You can always use some socks. There's a lot of family member things going on here right now. I'm gonna make it some socks. Cause you could I always use socks. The wisdom of the foodie beauty. Socks. Wow. Did you just lose? What, did you have a stroke then? Did you just lose your grip strength or something like that? It just like her hand just went limp and it just like fumbled out. And she said she was going to get them. Did she forget to cut that out? Because she clearly is broken. She probably can't afford even those fucking like multi pairs, sixty pairs of socks. But her hand just uh, and it just like stumbled out. What? What? Chocolate milk socks. Chocolate. One size, one pair, one percent, one percent what? One percent chocolate milk. Socks. Fresh taste. Hello, you. Hey, Goober. Why can't cows wear shoes? I ask that question every single day I see Foodie Beauty's toes. <laughs> because they lack toes. Oh, my God. Just like Foodie after diet babies. I missed that. <laughs> that progressed, like, kind of naturally there for me. Really, Goober, did you enjoy that one? Was it good? <laughs> yeah, she loved that one. She was like, that's top 10 jokes in the world, Daddy. Oh, now she's trying to the cat. She probably needs a shit. Why can't cows wear shoes? Oh because God. they lack toes. Oh my <laughs> gosh. <laughs> Goodbye.
Oh my gosh, goodbye. What? Did, why did she say it like that? She seemed like genuinely like upset about it. Is it simply because that did actually make her sonny think about her own toes and the diabetes? Ooh, these are cute. Are they? I gotta find a way to get earrings around my hijab. <laughs> Ear holes. <laughs> Ear holes, there you go, fantastic. Earrings, are, did she used to wear earrings? Like, that was more like an Amber Lynn thing. Excuse me, dude. Also, like, why does she care? Like, sure, because she doesn't wear, she already says, like, she spent all of her time in Kuwait, like, indoors. And obviously, Salah sees her without her hijab the entire time because she doesn't need to wear it in front of him because uh, allegedly they might be possibly maybe married. So, like, why would she care? It's like she said she's getting hair dye. It's like, why do you get hair dye when, like, no one sees your hair? You know where the pickles are? <laughs> Do you get it? Pick, pick, pickles. It's, it's, it's pick, pick, you know, pick, pickles. Because she eats them sometimes. Ah, ah, so funny. She looks like violently different than she did outside when we were like up close to her pores. Suddenly like, her pores are like all vanished. It's weird. It's almost like it's like a filter or something. I, I, I have no idea. I couldn't possibly say. And this is my Why do you casual keep doing outfit this? for today. Here's my casual outfit for today. It's the same thing I wear like fucking every other day. Well, thanks, Foodie. Thanks for letting me know. <laughs> I have a hat on. <laughs> do you have personality? <laughs> do you believe me yet that my family's here? Because it's weird because I'm not like, acting like there's anyone here with me or anything like that. Big head alert. She's not even. She's not even. Uh, big head alert. Fat. Fat head. There's a difference between big and fat. I'm just gonna fucking say. If you got a fat dick, it might be them thing. You got a big dick. It's different, okay? Like I'm just gonna make a point. Fat ass and big ass to you. I'm just gonna. Make, I, I thought it'd be gender neutral there. Um, <laughs> sorry. I, at no point has she like looked. You know, if you try like a stupid hat on or something in public, you might turn around to your family member or something like that. They like get their reaction to it, and they might just what the fuck are you. There's something like that, you know. But instead, she's like only staring directly at the camera. See? They have a plus size. She's not up. reacting to anyone. They've got a plus size. It only goes up to three X. You're a shit out of luck, kid. Up to three X, meaning probably not too much will fit me. Here. Yep. Yep. You are. Well, that's so weird. It's almost like you were pretending that you were a two X at one point, wasn't she? In like, like a, a Maurice or something like that. I can't remember what it's called, but she claims she has a two X there, but three X in general. But now it's up to three X. It's like, oh, no, it's not going to fit me. It's like, that's weird. Because I was making the joke because like, I'm always claiming that you're like 17 X. But weird that you're the one who claims you're 3X, but now apparently 3Xs don't fit you. This shirt for summer looks nice and light. Huh? I I'm... really like the style of this. Wow, I don't actually fucking care. <laughs> like, at all, surprisingly so. It's also 2X, so you are shit out of luck. I like this shirt. Does that make me relatable? Okay, have I turned the speed back up? I haven't, that's why. I was wondering partner, there. Like I said, it's pretty much like a Canadian Walmart. As you... You, li you didn't, as I said, you actually didn't say that at all, because I had no idea. Maybe you did, maybe I was making fun of you at the time. Honest to God, I'm really bad at this whole thing, because very often, I just say stuff over her, and I don't remember what she says. You can see they have things oh my pretty God, cheap. That's cheap. So, it's actually even cheaper than Walmart, oh. I've noticed. Is it? Maybe they're $10, because they look like fucking trash, and they know no one in the world will ever buy them. They had some really, really Look good at the deals, speed actually. we are going at. I remember I put us back up to 1.25. That was, just, and look how violent the rocking was. We were going like a 45 degree fucking angle every single time. It was like band down the hatches, boys, you're going through a storm. I've seen these things recently. I think VTubers did these. $1.50 for a bag of- Oh my God. <laughs> I, was about to, I was about to make fun of her, but unironically, I do love me some Epsom salt. I, I really do enjoy a good old bath. I like a good soak. These Epsom salt is pretty good deal. So wow. I'm just gonna get- a Like you could fit in a fucking bath of bags for taking baths back oh. home which you is can't fit in. i've seen your bath back home there's literally and i mean literally no chance that you can get in it and if there's literally no chance you can get it there's absolutely no fucking chance you can get out of it there is one time in japan i was just like you know what i had a sh i had a bath every day because i love japanese bath mm, fantastic they also have lots of baths lots of bath bombs and all over there and one hotel there was one bath that i got into and it's one of those ones you're in and you're just like because hmm. it was one like the really deep but really squat one so I was kind of like, like kneeing myself in the chin and I suddenly was very much aware it's like oh I am very unlikely to get out of this bath I will have to call for assistance and have people haul me the fuck out of here because there's no way I get out of this fucking bath that is her in every fucking bath she needs to get this and go to like what is it she's didn't she claim that her apartment sorry her seaside apartment had a swimming pool that's the only one she's fucking getting in
I do enjoy doing. Oh, which I um, uh, do in enjoy uh, doing. Even you don't believe it. I'm gonna get one eucalyptus and one I vanilla. Get one eucalyptus and probably just and mix the two together. Why would you mix eucalyptus and vanilla? That would smell fucking disgusting. <laughs> I'm gonna get one eucalyptus. Why'd you say it like it? You, you say it like I make fun of you saying it. Oh my gosh. My I god. I literally cannot even smell Hawaiian ginger without being traumatized from my teenage years. Okay, sure. I believe you. You guys remember this stuff? Remember, this is the woman. Do you guys remember this stuff? Uh, no. Remember, this is the woman who's pretending that her family are there with her. Remember this? We have a family day out. No, apparently there's no one near her. I want the prize. I want the prize. Is it because it's a fucking elephant? Here. Olive Garden Ranch. I can't believe this. Are we seriously just walking? Shut up. Are we seriously just walking around pointing at shit? Look, they have stuff here. There's sauce. There's crisps. These are my favorite. I spotted the right. I love these rice cakes, guys. Okay. I bet you go write in your fucking journal again, there, kid. I love the dill, and I also love the all dressed. So the only solution is get a bag of each. I found these gourmet. What the fuck is popcorn that tastes like orange and vanilla cream pop? Popcorn. Popcorn flavor. Gross. Very interesting. Would you guys try these? Uh, would you guys try these? Please comment below. Please. I know I've, di I've disabled likes and dislikes again, but please, please, please. I don't want you to fucking talk to me, please. I want you to recommend me to people again. I love this dill pickle powder. Uh, but I'm not do you remember it. that guy? She said, where's the pickles earlier? Cause she eats pickles. I'm like, imagine your personality being like 80% pickles. That's it. That's it. You're like fucking Christian, but instead of Sonichu, it's actually pickles. Okay. So they had like a- And not the pickles the way Sonichu, like Christian says them. It's a like pickle, that, you know, that pickle. Bargain sale section. And I a lot of people, that's not gonna make any sense. They have some tea on sale for less than two bucks. Wow. And I think Miss Milk Thistle is good for you, isn't it? I don't know. Then they had these like bargain bin can of peanuts. Wow. And ketchup and dill pickle are my favorite, so I hope they're not- This is genuinely, like, excruciatingly boring. <laughs> it is just like our going, I have this thing. I say you mentioned pickles again. Remember the way I established that my only personality is pickle early on? Yeah, they have it's p pickles. That, that's it. This is it. That's still. Oh Who even eats these giant hosts? You, probably. I don't get it, like... I bet you eat the fucking plastic as well. I get by. You eat your way through the cardboard and the plastic of these jalapeno cheese sauces. Fucking disgusting, Zoni. What's the matter, Goobs? Uh huh. Are you gonna lie to me again? Pretend you wanna go to take a shit? She was lying earlier on. She didn't even go. They sell Cineplex movie theater nacho cheese now wow. individually. Interesting. Wow. And I can go home and drink them. Don't interrupt my funny jokes. It's shake and bake, and I help. Oh yeah. my god, this is so boring, I'm skipping. And just a warning to all your haters, if you don't leave me alone, you're gonna oh. get super soaked. Oh yes, buddy. Oh yes. Okay, first he said, all your haters. <laughs> my haters? Are, are you gonna fight my haters? I, I appreciate that, but I think you're my hater. But I guess you are like fighting yourself. I did see you eat. Like, a three-person worth of fucking burrito pool with an entire family bag of crisp board on top. Technically, that's you fighting yourself, because I guarantee that is going to actually kill you. So, thank you for fighting my haters for me. But, like, I love the bit where it's like, she turned around and cut it to herself. And it's like the, have you ever heard, like, Red Letter Media do the, and action bit? Super soaked. It's like, and action. Mm -hmm. It's like, she turned the camera around to herself, and then it's like, looked to make sure she was in frame. And then started like pulling faces to it. It's like, why didn't you just cut the, the first bit out of you like looking to make sure that you were in frame before you did it? It would it would make more sense and not look as like unbearably cringe. But it's like it's hard not to look unbearably cringe when you're doing this here. Oh yes, this mug says La Vie est Belle. Oh yeah, sorry, we're going back to skipping again because born <laughs> you've missed nothing. Just her pointing and stuff. Going, I did the thing. This is like, thanks, Fadey. I wasn't sure. I've never been to first world country before. Oh, we're just out. Okay. Nope, we're back to driving once. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, Toys R Us, guys. I'm gonna go buy like, something for Salah. I'm probably gonna go to Thomas the Tank Engine or something like that. <laughs> I like trains. Oh my god! Go somewhere! I'm not like this. Like teleport. <laughs> So guys, how are you enjoying those mid-roll ads? Mm, I hope you are. <laughs> By the All way, right, pickles. Spot. Now we are at the 
Shopping. That's a weird way to say, not I am at. Oh, and it's time to get down to business. You're by yourself, you fucking lunatic. Is, you, is it just like that earlier? Is that chat in the room with us right now? You sound mental. You sound genuinely like there are voices in your head. You have like fucking, I don't know, the Sally is like a voice in her head saying, going, yes, foodie, shit on the haters, shit on them violently. I cannot wait. Wow. Oh my god, a pigeon! Guys, a pigeon! Oh my god, guys, a bench! Some steps! Uh, people sitting, probably not wanting to be filmed by me. Stairs! Oh my god, fitness queen! Huff! 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 She actually goes down like a fucking toddler. You know why most people go down steps? You know, like most normal people without any form of disabilities or anything like that. She goes like one step and then brings the elephant onto that step. One step, brings the elephant onto that step. One step, brings the elephant. It's like, bro, how the fuck can you not just go like step, 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 down? That's it. Th two steps, three steps down. Wow. Oh my God, look, more balls than Chantel's ever seen in her entire life. Still good? Yep, you're still walking. Oh, there's a cinema and it's closed, guys. Bet you thought that was it. You didn't think that was interesting. Oh, fuck, I hope you thought that was interesting. An, el an escalator. An escalator. You're a wild woman. Oh, freshly squeezed bubble tea. I'm glad we're focusing on First, that. First, into this really cool local store wow. called Ottawa. Loves local. Like you, and they just like you gave a fuck. You have talked about the evil decadent West repeatedly. Like you gave a fuck about local Ontarian stores. Talked like a whole. I mean, yes, I'm saying Ontarian. I don't know if that's the right word for it, but I'm saying it. Bunch of different really cool craft items. Oh my god, like, that's crazy um, earrings, candles, like uh, earrings, candles, bracelets. You know, stuff like that. Homemade wow. tumblers. What we like to refer to as fucking tat. There's different kinds of homemade treats from oh local vendors. Oh my god, bath bombs. Cute oh my god, look at these cute Easter bath bombs, which are from the evil, disgusting Christian religion. Cups and candles. Oh, okay. Yeah, they were, like, just the cutest. They were, and like, uh, just, um, like, uh, the cutest. <laughs> Wow, you don't even sound like you give a shit. It's like chili flavored gummy candies. Oh my god, are we seriously really just doing this thing again where you're just walking around pointing at stuff going, they have this, the thing exists! Interesting to know what spicy candy. Chewy! Peach! <laughs> Why chewy and peach? It's going to be a chewy, crunchy, something like that. It's like chewy, peachy. Do you taste Strawberry! Like? And these cute dragons and like little emojis. Oh my god! Come on. Come on. Really? Really? This feels nearly deliberate. Why is there shit here? Uh, is this like a secret code to Sala? It's like begin operation, start live streaming again. And I guess I heard it. I haven't seen it yet, but apparently Sala did a live stream where he walked around Q8, I guess. And in Q8, I guess that like, he's live streaming his walk and like claiming if you want to watch it in 4K, just click on like the, the wee options button, you know, the wee options button, but sentence button down here and change it to like you kind of can't see that because there's a potato dog in front of that. But, you know, just trust me. There's just options there. But he's like, changing to 4K there. And he live-streamed it in 720p. So you can't change it to 4K. But they're like, if you want to see this in 4K, it's like, you guys are fucking shit. How did you not learn this from Thailand? They made the exact same claim in Thailand. Dragons and like... Oh, sorry. I got totally distracted by the shit, I guess. Little emoji thing. Little uh, emo Poop. emoji thing. I don't even know what that is. Never mind, actually. <laughs> she's so awkward because you're always going to say little poop emojis. And obviously in her head, she's sitting like, oh... Oh, FFG. <laughs> FFG, I think, uses those, like, all of her things, though. Chains and this weird cup holder. Yeah. And, like, stuff and, like, things and, like, stuff. It's just like, oh, my God, you sound so bored. Why do you think I'd enjoy this if you sound so fucking bored? I bet you would, Ryan Reynolds. I bet you would like that drink on your face, wouldn't you? <laughs> and <laughs> I... Oh, my God, that's so funny. She, like, responded to her... Coaster? <laughs> All right, Ken, you do, you do. Oh, I'm sorry, we're skipping again until any, literally anything happens. But yeah. Why? Hi. We just keep randomly cutting back to like her just like filming herself. I don't know. Maybe she thinks she's like hot shit or something like that, but it's even more awkward when it's not her talking to us like live. This is like all like pre-recorded and then she's done a voiceover for it. I'm assuming she's doing it this way because she's too socially awkward to like be walking around Canada like filming herself and actually speaking because she's generally would be, be up. I, I guess like she realizes there are people around who would understand her. It might not be as awkward in like Thailand or um, in Kuwait because they don't understand what she's saying. So you'd feel less uncomfortable from like walking around speaking English. Um, what the fuck? <laughs> she, I, thought, I was like, 
Are those sea pop marks? And I'm like, oh no, wait, those are her glasses, aren't they? Because they're so high up. <laughs> My husband bought me these amazing glasses, guy. I hear it where 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 your fake lumberjack boyfriend's buying you glasses that definitely fit you right and definitely be pushed on your nose. You really wanted them to. Look at those things. Like I said, it's just more awkward because he keeps just like randomly cutting back to her. And says, hey, okay. Especially because now she's in like entirely different clothes. I think. So let's like, I thought this is like a shopping day with your family. <laughs> uh, I'm going out for a shopping day with my family in different clothes. Or did you have to travel back every single time you went to your store? Did you have to travel back and change clothes because you fucking sweated so much from walking for 10 feet? <laughs> <laughs> right. Why the fake laugh? <laughs> oh, I'm so funny because I said hi. Do you remember that? Do you remember like in all my couple's vlogs, we always went, hi, hello. At the camera because we don't actually have a personality. We don't know how to talk to a camera. Here we are, lush. Yay. Like I said, I have some gift cards for my birthday to spend oh here. Oh my god. And I'm I so wait. bored. Yeah, we're skipping. I don't care about lush. And some posh white chocolate and rose. Damn. I to try some of. These are three hundred and twenty pound fancy girl. Oh my god. She's deeper than that desk is. <laughs> Oh my god, they might come and set samples on her. They might mistake her for that fucking table back there. Whoa, she's a big one. Oh, she's big today. Damn, son. I guess. Like, the is the camera moving? Oh, the camera is actually moving. I was wondering maybe she had set it down somewhere or something like that. But I guess there's someone with her. I'm assuming it's probably going to be a sales rep or something like that. I, 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 that is my assumption. Because there's been nothing to suggest, like, her family is with her, like, whatsoever this entire time. Also, she walked around, pointed to a whole bunch of stuff earlier on. It's like, I'm getting this, and I'm going to get this, and I'm going to get this. And I mysteriously, she doesn't have any of that. So she picked it up and showed it to the camera, and then she put it back down again. It's like, if you're getting it, why are you putting it back down again? <laughs> Clearly, you're not getting it. Never smelled before. Oh, my God. So I saw that they had a perfume card here. Oh, and my God. I decided to smell one called Alina. And it Ugh, look at this. <laughs> what is with her tits? I'm going to say that every single time now. Like... Like, what is it? Because it's like, we actually have like a, like an actual valley between them now. Is this like a corset? Like, <laughs> I go, okay, probably not a corset. <laughs> probably not a corset for her, Danny girl. I don't think they're designed to fit around someone like her. What is it? Has she only like upgraded to like the fucking biggest padded push-up bra or something like that that's ever existed? Um, Fantastic. She's going to wear perfume, I guess. It's weird that you want to get perfume from this company when your husband works at, well, sorry, owns, sorry, I forgot. He's a super billionaire or something like that. He owns a perfume company. So why would you be getting perfume here? That doesn't make sense. It's like if my like girlfriend sold cars, I wouldn't go to some random guy to buy a car and buy it off her because I'd probably get it cheaper. It actually smells really, really good. Wow, wow. I have to research the wow. story behind it. I have to research the story behind it? Behind what? The perfume? Well, one day, John Jacob Jacobson decided, I like the smell of fucking, I don't know, salmon. So I decided to make a salmon, a salmon perfume. I don't know why I went salmon first, but okay. Salmon. God, I just, we're so boring today. Can we do anything? Sit on your knees. Get them all lunch. Okay, I'm just going to skip to here because she decided to show this bag. And she, of course, didn't show us what's in the bag. <laughs> Obviously, this is pretty much like the only angle we've seen of it so far. Maybe we'll see it later on. But this is the only angle we've seen of it so far. Because she walked around and said, I'm getting this and 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 this. Like, the amount of stuff she pointed out and claimed. In soap bars alone, you know, our our dainty Miriam, who definitely, definitely looks like she actually bathes, is getting five bars of soap at once. Yes, five bars of soap at once. Even though they're available in QA. It's not like you need to, like, rush to get these things because obviously you can just get them in q8 so i don't know why you're making such a big deal about it unless your gift card only works there and it's like five thousand dollars because like just the soap alone like the five ones she pointed out is it's it's like sixty dollars worth of soap just soap i'm not talking about her face cream she claims she's getting the shampoo she claims she's getting the bath bomb she claims she's getting the massage bar she would pretend to get because my husband will love these because she's still pretending like her husband touches her and also exists, I guess. Like, it's like she genuinely must have pretended to have spent like $250 in Lush. Like, and it's like, okay. <laughs> Whatever you need to tell me to make yourself feel like more of a winner in life, bro, I don't, you fucking pop off, you do it. Here's a bag that well, doesn't look like it has nearly as much stuff as she claimed. Look how slow we're walking. Now, I don't know if you've oh. ever had kernels pop. Guys, cheesy dill. It's a pickle!
Oh my god, dildoid, it's also a pickle. Fuck me. But it's so good. So I decided to pick up a small cheesy. I decided to pick up a small one because I'm like so dainty and I'm definitely not gonna stuff my fucking face across the next three live streams or anything like that. Mmm, so dainty guys. Dill flavor. It's one of my favorite flavors. Oh my god, it's much pickle. And dill is a win. Pickle, guys. So after the mall, we were pretty hungry and we decided we to stop at the green. Burn our fucking head, man. It is. There's only one shadow! Probably the best, arguably, vegetarian restaurant in Ottawa. And. Oh Why are we going to a vegetarian restaurant? I don't suddenly think. It's so. What, what is she lying? Like, I'm assuming her, her family must watch her videos because they obviously don't fall for this. She's like, who is she trying to play to in this? It's like, uh, with, with her with her aunt. Well, guys, we're having cauliflower pizza. Mm -hmm. I really care about my health. So I don't want any carbs or anything. I'm a cauliflower crust only on my pizza. Yes, guys. And we're going out and we're going to um, the finest. Uh, vegetarian restaurant it's like bro like you give a fuck you're about to go home and deep through like six subways probably we love it so we oh haven't been God. there in a while but boy let me tell you we haven't been there in a while like well i would assume no shit since you were in qa so i'm gonna assume probably yeah everything was so expensive Why are you more so than i remember boring? so everything's expensive it looks like it's like an all you need thing so far what well, yeah <laughs> just be wary what's expensive you pay by weight um and it's hard to really you pay by weight of like what like everything in t or do you have to put everything in individual bowls that doesn't make sense know how much everything is going to cost until they weigh it sure so i'm picking up some marinated mushrooms this is but like these things all have like vastly different weights and like it'd be different like like seaweed is generally like expensive enough like and seaweed weighs a lot less than mushrooms which are dirt cheap so that it doesn't make sense old salad bar they were out of a lot of things because we came after the lunch rush they but that didn't look they were out of a lot of things well evidently not because i can see that the bowls are all fucking full it's broccoli salad some marinated spring what are you greens about? or spring mix oh look at that I'm empty bowl there some of their spicy kimchi it's very delicious they make everything in house uh-huh sure every day oh look at all this empty stuff you know because they're out of it because it's empty why would eat why do you even make this claim it's weird Gosh, and here's the hot bar we have vegetarian lasagna oh tofu, my god cheese, rice spicy peanut tempeh mashed potatoes with Fantastic. cheese and kale and this is Jeez, this is literally like, guys, I start up a stream and go, okay, guys, before I start this video, before I get into, like, reactions and start talking to you guys, I'm going to name you every book on the shelf beside me. And I'm sorry, you're just going to have to deal with it because I want more mineral ads. It's like if I started the video like that. And she just walks and goes, they have this and 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 this. And it's like, yeah, hoodie, I get visual medium. I can I can see what the fuck is in front of you? You're pointing a camera at it. This is what my plate ended up being piled on with. Yep. And that's a spanakopita, this triangle thing Fantastic. here. Fantastic. It has spinach and And I got and this dill. and, and this, this. actually is a $40, $40 plate. Wow. Uh, whenever she rang it up and told me the price, I was- I thought someone else exists. In shock. But uh -huh. I did get quite a bit of food, but- Of course you did. You got three people's worth of fucking food. Man, that was pricey. It was very pricey. Well, it's a vegetarian restaurant. Vegetarian restaurants generally are just more expensive. That is just, that's just the thing. Like, a lot of people complain about you know, going vegetarian because it is generally quite expensive. It's like if you go like full paleo. Like, full paleo is generally quite expensive in itself. Carbs are generally, like, the, I don't know, probably, like, the best, you know, price to, like, calorie ratio in the world. Like, um, that's also why, like, carbs are generally always the staple foods of, like, everywhere that ever existed there. So, yeah. But you also have... A massive plate stacked like six inches high with shit. Like, obviously, yes, it's going to cost much. Overall, the ambiance at this place. Ambiance? Really cool. and She's so cultured, guys. I wish I was a cultured as foodie the beauty. And again, they make everything fresh and organic, so it is worth the price. What is, the what is the ambiance? <laughs> like, the biggest problem is you, you should be able to like, define what an ambiance is. You should be able to say all oh, the music that they're playing was so nice. Oh, I love the interior deck decorating oh my god i really like the seats the seats are so comfortable now like like the way they fit it oh, it was so interesting or oh, like the you know live jazz musician come out and he would come out and he had to take requests and oh it's fantastic that's like the ambiance or like even like the customers can incl be included in the ambiance now, i like the ambiance of it because there's fucking peppers i don't know <laughs> like you just, you just sound so uncultured while trying to sound cultured that comes from me, who, as you know, quite uncultured. Oh my god, look at road! Oh my god, look at footpath! 
Oh my god, 202B! Oh balloon. my god, a balloon! <laughs> I don't care, foodie. I just, I just don't care. It's Anyways, beautiful. Guys, I hope you're enjoying the vlog so far. I'm not, it's fucking dark. Bro, they would have to pre-fucking grease this for you to fit down here, holy fuck. I hope you're enjoying the vlog so far. What about the mid-roll ads? Have you enjoyed them? I made sure they weren't skippable this time. Haha, <laughs> bitches. <laughs> I hope you've been enjoying the vlog so far. Of you mindlessly just walking around going, Look at this thing! This thing exists! I was like, yep, foodie, I guess it does. Wow. I hope you've been enjoying the vlog so far. Oh, now I'm going to very slowly walk down an alleyway. Uh-huh. Did you enjoy the mid-roll for that one? Uh-huh, I hope you fucking did. There's going to be three more. This little scary alleyway to get to the car. Why is it scary? It's It's well lit. It's well lit and painted orange. <laughs> None of that suggests scary. It's it's so tight. There's literally nowhere anyone can pop out from. And you walking down it, no one will try and come the other way because they know they will never fit past you. Even if you turn side on, I think that would actually block them more. Oh, it's so scary, guys. She's deep breathing. Look, she, look we can see like, like, okay, so how far she walked? 10 feet? We can see like the daylight there. She has walked 10 feet and she's already deep breathing from walking 10 feet. The rest of the people. She had a jump cut. <laughs> no! Fady, God damn it, why? I'm with today, uh... The rest of the people that I'm with today, the one other person, there was one person at that table. Because I could see that, you know, the, the table that she's setting up wasn't overly wide. There were two glasses set out, okay? There was not, all, all the people I'm with today, oh, like the millions of friends she has. You're looking in like a bookstore and sure. honestly. And honestly, uh, I can't read, so I thought I wouldn't go in with that. I thought it'd be a waste of time, honestly, guys. I still haven't got through the Quran yet. I'm still on page 47, like, but all right. I feel, I, I'll, 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 Maybe, maybe, maybe do that when I get, maybe, maybe, I don't fucking know, actually. There were some big words in there and they kind of scare me. Um, I'm just not interested, so I'm going to the car to get water. Wow. You're so, uh, guys, I'm only here for a short period of time and I, I want to live my life to my fullest and spend my time with the people that I love. And they went to a bookstore and I was like, ugh, that sucks. I don't even like books, so I'm going to the car. <laughs> I gotta go and sit in the car by myself. Because people wanted to go to a bookstore, and I was like, ugh, no, I don't like that. So I, I, I laughed. I laughed even though we're meant to have a, having a family day out. I refused to spend time with them. And I just went and sat by myself in the car because this does not include me buying food for myself. <laughs> I would be embarrassed. Why would you Sorry, admit guys, that? I had a few moments alone, and I'm waiting for people oh to Oh my god, what's I have a few moments alone? Because the voices in my head have finally gone quiet. <laughs> There's no one there, Fiddy! To the car. I'm just gonna end the video here. So I just. Oh my god, are you gonna end the video here? That's so incredible. I'm so happy that you're gonna do that. Why are you talking like this? It's fucking weird. We've got two minutes left. How long does it take you to end a fucking video? Shopping with me. I know you guys like shopping vlogs. No one does. No one. There, so, yeah. I know you like shopping, you know, like so sometimes. Even she doesn't buy it. Um, an example of a kind of day out we usually do shopping and lunch. Or oh, yeah, that we usually do. Because, like, you know, I usually hang out with people. Like, totes, like, for real, like, all the time. Like, I'm, like, real social and stuff like that. And then when people go to bookshops, I just fucking band them. But and I we're actually just gonna go to park probably, so. Sure, um, oh yeah. I... Uh, usually after I go and have my lunch and then go to a bookstore and go to Lush and also change clothes. Usually what I do after that is go to a park for a walk around. You know, this woman who was deep breathing after walking 10 feet. Oh yeah, yeah, we're going to go for a park for a walk together. Cause that, that's definitely just like normal. That's just normal for her. She loves doing that. I get a few snippets of that, but I'm gonna end the video here. So wow, sure. and the weather was beautiful. Like it was. I don't give a fuck about the weather, kid. Oh my god, no. There's a mi Oh my god. Ugh. There's a minute and a half of just fucking dandering around at the end. Oh my god, bird! A oh, fucking bird! Jesus fucking Christ! I can't. I can't. I'm assuming there's no talking during this. I'm assuming not. No. It's just that she's just seriously just playing fucking like cover of free music in the background while filming a fucking goose. Ugh. Unless she's filming a fucking buffalo. Why would you do that? The goose is way more attractive. <laughs> Look at her! Look at the Walmart fucking greener smile she has on her. Oh, I love it. Oh, this is really fun. I really enjoy this grommet. <laughs> she has a fucking Wilson grommet smile on her. <laughs> this is so ridiculous. Look how happy I am. Oh, this is so good. Oh, oh, I love walking. Exercise is great. 
I fucking hate this. This is the worst thing I've ever seen. I guess that's gonna be it, guys. I don't know. Oh god, I'm I'm busy, so I don't have a lot of time recently, guys. A bunch of things have come up, so I, I don't have a lot of time to be filming stuff like that. So maybe on the weekend I'll try and get some stuff up, but who knows, guys? That's gonna be it, guys. Have a good one. Take care of yourselves. Bye bye.